Hi everyone! Are you running out of ideas on how to use up the excess food that you have accumulated in your freezer and kitchen cupboard? Don't worry, today's recipe is a simple one-pot solution to help you clear out your fridge and kitchen cupboard of frozen food, fresh food, leftovers and even canned food. While I've provided a recipe, it serves as a guide to give you an idea of what you can do with the food that is lying in your freezer or fridge or kitchen cupboard. There is no hard and fast rule on what you can put into the stew. You can toss in meat, fish, seafood that you have in your freezer, leftover fresh or leftover cooked vegetables in your fridge, canned food from your larder. Anything goes as long as it's still usable and not gone bad. Using a non-stick pot for this stew is useful because you can brown the luncheon meat and sausages without using any oil. The base of the stew is mainly from onion and tomato. When sautéing the onion, you can add in a little bit of olive oil to help it fry. Sauté the onions until they are softened. Add in a little bit of garlic for extra aroma if you have them. Then in with the diced tomatoes. The onions and tomatoes combined add a lot of natural sweetness to the stew. A lot of sweetness will also come from sweet corn, well, if you're using them. If you have any meat bones in your freezer, defrost those, blanch them, and use them to boil up a stock to add to your stew. If not, just use plain water. That's fine too because all the ingredients will contribute to a lot of flavour. For my stew, I threw in pizza sauce and fresh white butter mushrooms that I had left over from preparing pizza earlier on. Cover and cook for 15 minutes over high heat. Then add in the luncheon meat, sausages or ham if you have any. If you have canned food like canned mushrooms, black olives, throw them in as well towards the end of the cooking time as these do not require a long time to cook. Same goes with your mixed vegetables whether they are canned or frozen. And there you have it! Your one pot dinner or lunch is cooked. Using so many ingredients at once can result in a hefty pot of stew. Well, what do you do? Share it with your neighbours so that nothing goes to waste. Hope you enjoyed this recipe and that it will inspire you to clear out your fridge and larder. And remember, don't overbuy the next time you go grocery shopping. Happy cooking!